So I am in downtown Houston. As you can see, I'm uh, I'm a half a block over from where I'm parked. Behind me over there is the brewery, and this apparently is a little uh, walking trail, a little uh, urban renewal in the middle of uh, a little bit of industrial decay over here. I moved over to a new location this morning early because I've got a buddy over here, another school bus guy, who's got a studio, art studio over here, and uh, was going to go meet him for lunch, and uh, he invited me to, to stay here overnight, and the best thing about this, other than the location, is that right there. He says, I can use this is 110. Which is pretty cool. It's almost like being in the campground. And, uh, I'm uh, waiting on my friend, Don. And we're going to go hang out at a bar called Rehab. <laughs> Sounds pretty cool. They've got blues there, although not tonight. But uh, that's, uh, that's our plan tonight. We had a good lunch today and uh, rode around and saw some of the sights today which I'm sure you're gonna see and uh, this is Don's gig right here pretty cool huh well maybe we'll get something interesting tonight at the bar called rehab So, is the size commensurate with what he thinks of the president, or how does that work? Because obviously Andrew Jackson's bigger than, uh, yeah, who's this? The ones, he's a history nut, too. Yeah, he okay. Good at it. The ones who had the most respect for are the biggest. Got it. Uh, Lincoln's a little bigger. Uh, LBJ's kind of small back over there. Yeah. That the vehicles are out here that give it a little bit of scale. Wow. That is insane. This is a 1946 one and a half ton Chevrolet Shorty school bus. All the parts of which are cut and laying over here. This will come out. 24 inches and then there'll be a fold-up section that comes up another 24 inches so when I'm docked drop it down I'll have a little back patio here place to store some extra things 